it's a second down and goal. LSU trailing by one. Dixon sets up to the left side. They'll hand it off in the middle. Of the Touchdown, LSU. And they're going to go for two, obviously. This is real. It's the first down. Under two to go. LSU brings four. Cox. Tavares King. Wide open. Cox and drops at the 15. And they must score a touchdown. A field goal will not help them. Second and ten. Cox in the corner. Man for man. Cox. What a play. A.J. Green. What a play. Wow! This penalty celebration here means that LSU with two timeouts in a minute nine is going to get a shot at a field goal. Jasper's long 52 yards means he needs to get it to about the 35 yard line. Holiday and Brooks. This will be Trendon Holiday. Flag is down. Holiday is not. There's a flag. How big is this flag back at the 12 yard line? Well, I just, it's got to be too many men, doesn't it? It was, it was thrown from behind. The kicking team only had three on one side of the kicker. That's an illegal formation. The five-yard penalty is added to the end of the run. First down. Oh, the new rules because of the onside kick is you have to have three, excuse me, four players to the right. When they come out of the huddle and quick kick it, only three guys go to the right of the kicker. He's eight of nine for the year. Now they had problems with the snap and the hold on an extra point last week, but that was in the range. Well, they're already in field goal range, but of course you don't want your kicker to go for 50 yards. Will they get a quarterback draw? Yeah, I'm... Scott, oh, what a run! Whoa! Here goes Scott, touchdown LSU! get blocked on that one he got blocked and then from the opposite side marcus downton number 38 runs right through a tackle and doesn't wrap up 33 yards we saw not much for three quarters and we're seeing everything in the last five minutes lsu will go for two 46 seconds to go. Really, really didn't like the celebration penalty that changed the whole strategy of the game. There's a touchdown. Did he just say another celebration penalty to be enforced on the kickoff? I didn't hear it. Yes. Looks like oh, my got... goodness. You know, in a moment, Jefferson. Wow. Good. Who else, Brent? Right side. Intercepted. Wins it today. In exciting fashion, the Tigers defeat Georgia 20 to 13. It was Perry Wright. Six times and then a wide receiver three or four times each game. Picked up the first down 
on the last play. First and 10 LSU trying to be the first to score. Good protection in the end zone. Wide open is D'Angelo Peterson with his first touchdown catch of 2009. on first down and 10. They trail by one. This is the pistol formation. And off Scott, up the middle, big open, breaks the tackle. Now the chase is on. Kareem Jackson from behind. Two receivers left. Jarrett Lee with the change. Hand off. Ridley bounces off the tackle of Reamer. Heads for the corner. Touchdown, Tigers. And Les Miles wants to go for two. Second down. McElroy drifting right. Nobody open. Wow. Did he catch that? That was that intercepted? Well, Peterson caught it. I'll tell you that. He got a foot in, I think. Oh, he was tucking the ball, though. He was tucking the ball away. This oh. is going to be close. My goodness. It's under further review. We do. I did not hear what the ruling on the field was. Incomplete. Incomplete. Patrick Peterson. What a play. His right foot. I thought his right toe came down. Watch this. Mm. Gee. Looked to me like his right toe came down. The, di the difference between a corner and a safety. Peterson ate this one up. His foot definitely, you see the dirt come up? Yeah. His foot definitely touched the ground. That's the divot. Well, now Tom Ritter. After review, the ruling on the field stands, incomplete pass. Third down. Big, each in his own way. <laughs> Time now for the play of the game presented by Outback Steakhouse with the call. Our old friend Eli Gold with the Alabama Radio Network. Here now is the first and ten. Bama from their own 27. Trent Richardson behind the quarterback. McElroy looks right, throws the screen left. Julio left side. He's behind the defense. 40. 30, 20, 10, 5, 73 yards, touchdown! The official on the field says he went out of bounds. And the official who made the call is Rob Skelton, the field judge. He was also the man who signaled touchdown. Here's Sheen. Blocked. It's blocked and heading toward LSU's direction. Picked up, and the foot race is on. It's Patrick Peterson, touchdown LSU. Fourteen. LSU with a one-point lead at 7-6. Jefferson in the end zone, caught, touchdown, Reuben Randall, the freshman, a yards by Patrick Peterson for an LSU touchdown, he's three of four, got it.
23-yard field goal. Eight-point margin. Jefferson deep in the right corner, man is open. It's caught, touchdown. Ruben Randall, number two, his second grab for a TD in the ball game. And what did they do? They went deep on Bree. He's been so aggressive, he squatted and he ran right by him. You just... They have Ridley, and we'll see. Again, for the tie. They are coming. Old Miss is bringing them all. That's LaFell in motion. Jefferson with pressure. Incomplete. to have four players to the other side of the kicker. Oh, he got it! LSU has it! Brandon LaFell in perfect stride. That ball never bounced up high. LaFell took it like a grounder. Watch it skip, 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 and LaFell grabs it. Never had to stop at all. Perfect stop. From almost right here. Yep. What about 25 yards? Here comes the blitz again. Jefferson lets it go. LaFell out of a tackle. Still surging to the 30-yard line. The wide receiver screen. When you're well, I thought they'd run something inside because they were in field goal range already. Third and 19 with 32 seconds to go. LSU can stop the clock one more time. They might be coming again, Ole Miss. No, they're not. Little quick screen out to the left. Ridley in trouble. Fourth down. Patrick Trahan, number seven. And they lost seven more. Nice job by Trahan that time doing his assignment. He had Ridley. He never let him get outside. That was a screen pass called all the way. And Trahan, the senior, does a great job. Final timeout used by Les Miles and the Tigers. They're looking at fourth and 26. And the Rebels of Ole Miss think they might have this one. No, I really miss the NFL. Yeah, right. I think LSU has two options here. They could just throw the Hail Mary with their tall receivers and try right. to catch it. Remember, they need a first down. It is fourth down and long. Or they could call the Boise State lateral play. Right. Well, they have to get to the 22-yard line in order to have one more play. Nine seconds remaining in the ballgame. You realize Stanford and Cal playing today. Have to be careful if you're LSU. You take too long in a lateral play. Even if you make it, there might not be any time left to kick the field goal. Fourth down and 26. Ole Miss has five up front, six back. Jefferson is mailed as he lets it go. It's caught! Tolliver with one second left. 
Get your field goal team on. You have to get your field goal team on.